People always want to make a contribution to a national park, a way of paying back, and the best way of doing that is through volunteering. And we have two main types of volunteer. We have the volunteers who get engaged in practical conservation. They can do something that, that gives a practical benefit, whether it's path work, whether it's habitat creation, and then they can move on. They can do that without any commitment and move on, and that's fantastic. That's a real great way of experiencing a national park. And we have another type of volunteer, we have volunteer rangers, and that's a little bit more detailed because people who do that have to show a much greater level of commitment. It's at least 12 months in the training, and the reason for that is that at the end of that training, those people will wear exactly the same uniform as full-time members of staff. When the public approach them on the hill, they're not going to realise that through the week they could be a lawyer or a bank worker or even a building site labourer, they're going to see a ranger and they will expect the same high professional standards from that person as they would from a professional ranger. We make sure that we can have quality training to enable them to deliver it. They, in turn, bring real dedication, real commitment to do that week in, week out throughout the year.